What's your favorite thing about shooting service rifle? You may move your next firing member to the line. My favorite thing about shooting service rifle is competition and challenging myself among my peers. Um, the competition is what's drive me. Honestly, the favorite thing, I guess, is just coming out. You could have a good day, you could have a bad day, but it's always going to be something new. Like, it's you're not always going to expect him to win it. So it's more like you're competing against yourself as opposed to, like, other people. Just developing a skill and uh, a load and putting together a rifle to make it shoot where you point it. Even though you're going trying for first place like any other sport, you're also trying for your personal best but everyone helps each other out too to get there. So if you need a hand, someone's there. If you can help someone, you can. I think it's uh, the people I'm out here shooting it with, honestly. Uh, just have a great team out here, and then everyone's so inviting, and I uh, just wanted to help you. Just great folks out here, you know. Everyone's gonna have a smile on their face, even on their worst days. Just being out with my friends and everything, my team is such amazing. Um, we have so much fun just shooting together. I love to shoot, it's my favorite thing to do. The community, um, you know, seeing everybody, you know, um, throughout the year and then coming here to Camp Perry and you get to see everybody all at the same time and it's like even though we missed um, 2020, it was like um, just, you know, one year later, it seems like there was no break in time um, and just the, definitely the community here. My favorite thing would probably have to be both the competition and just the family aspect that we have out here and the, just the atmosphere. Service rifle is a tremendous history involved with the service rifle and weapons that men have used in the military. Uh, I'm proud to be just a part of that. Uh, anything to do with the service rifles and things that we used, uh, the military is something extra special and uh, just being part of that just is that's that's all it is for me you know look, the playing field is level we're all using the same weapons and these are the weapons we use here and uh, it's everything for me I spent 26 years in the army it's not only the rifle that I used in the military um, it helps bring me back and I, I get to shoot it again so, and I also get to be around the people that I used to be with and I, I get to compete against them again so it, it brings the camaraderie back, brings back the things that I used to know and hopefully get back up to that level and beat them. You know the service rifle uh, for me and the, the warriors that we train, um, it's the one we trained with on active duty so it's quick and easy for uh, most of our warriors, it's you know served after 1975. So um, although the sport is new, precision shooting is new. Using a weapon that we all trained with and how it operates, that part is simple for a lot of our warriors. So um, we just enjoy shooting the um, you know the AR. It's a good weapon. Uh, well, my favorite part about shooting service rifle from a veteran aspect is all veterans are familiar with this weapon system, so they, they all come into this program understanding the very basic fundamentals of marksmanship, so it's a lot easier for them to, to adapt to this type of competition. And even for those that may not be familiar with this weapon system, or this rifle anyway, uh, it's so user friendly, it's so easy to adjust. It's basically formatted now for anybody, any shape, size, uh, and feature to be able to pick up this rifle and be successful with it. Uh, service rifle is a very physical sport, so it's a lot of using your bone structure and your muscle to actually shoot. Um, unlike some, something like F class where you're actually laying down and you're using a rest, this has to be you and the gun. And I like that challenge. It's, it's, it's a tough sport. My favorite thing, honestly, has to be the offhand. Just, just the challenge that comes from it, and it kind of shows who's really practiced what they've gotten. It really changes the game and the layout because if it's really windy, the offhand scores aren't going to be very good. And if it's not windy, it's going to be a real challenge to shoot super high. It's the challenge, the challenge of yourself and just trying to get a better score every time and testing new equipment and just perfecting the sport. I love service rifle because it's so competitive. Um, I shot small bore before coming over to service rifle 
And the rapid fire is exciting. It brings a lot of excitement to this sport. And of course, standing is always the biggest challenge. For me, it's probably the, the prone position at 600. Yep. Yep. I've, I haven't shot a lot of service rifle. I've, I've shot some F-class and some other stuff. So the standing and the you know, offhand's a little, a little rough for me, but uh, prone. There's something about just that 600 yard can sometimes be almost uh, like zen-like yoga where you're just sitting there, you, the wind, the rifle, paying attention to nothing but you and the nature, and it could be wonderful.